So yep, I have both of my Duchess on. I don't know which one will be perfect, but hopefully I'm gonna review on them soon. So please continue to watch my review later on. Um, so thanks for watching. Please like, comment down below. Bye. Okay, I'm back and I'm gonna do my review. This is what I got in the mail today, both of my Duchess Swan. So I'm so excited for her. Um, this is the one I'm gonna unbox and this one is not. So, let's get started. Here we have the front case of the box of Duchess Swan. Daughter of the Swan Queen, her artwork. She's a royal. And here we have the side of the box. Ever after high, Duchess Swan, the daughter of the Swan Queen. And on this side we have the back of the box. This box got really smaller. I need a quick look of it so you can get a good read of it. And these are three characters. It's Kitty Cheshire, the one I'm gonna order soon. And Lizzie Hearts that I have already. And then Gingerbread House. And here's the artwork of Duchess Swan. So I'm gonna do a comparison on the box. I'll be right back. As you can see, I got the Lizzie Hearts box. It's basically the same height, the only thing is. This, the newer box are like way smaller. Let me show you. Here go that box. They're like way different now. You see how the spine used to be on the side of the artwork? I liked it the old better. The newer one, not the artwork of the front with the name. The box are way slimmer now. And they both got, this one got the, um, the pages filling on top. <laughs> And then this one doesn't, this one's like a whole, I guess, the spinal, I don't even know how I would describe it, but I did like to throw all the way the box, so I'm going to get her halfway out of the package to so get a better look of her now. And here she is, halfway out of the package already. She is very beautiful, I love this doll, well I love all the dolls. Here we have her, um, I guess her diary, but it's a bookmark that tells more about her. She's a royal. And she got a silver brush, and I mean she got a silver stand. The stand's in this keyhole instead of the hole being in the back. So now I'm going to get this doll all the way out of her packaging so you can get a better, better look of her. Here we have Duchess Swan, the daughter of the Swan Queen. Um, she's out of the box, but I think she's gorgeous and really detailed. As you can see, I'm just going to do a quick view. Here's the back of her. So, I think she's really perfect. I think this is a must have to your collection of Ever After High. She does come with a silver brush, silver stand, and her story. So I'm going to show you more of her story book, but let me do this first. Here she has her headpiece with a feather going this way black with the beads right here in front of her forehead with her lavender color flower feathers and stuff in her hair. Her hair has black, white, and lavender. Her eyes are brown, with the eyebrows, pink lips, or bright red, I don't know what color it is, and her necklace. And then here's her top piece, ruffles her hair, straps, her corset, her skirt, there's a three piece, this, this piece, and this piece, and that one. And then she has a ring on, that's a swan. And then her purse is pink with a swan on it. 
And then she has a bracelet with the swan on it. And then basic fish netting leggings. And then her ballet slippers with the bows on the side. I think that's really cute. So, like I said, if you collect ever after high, this would be a good doll for you to collect. 